Hello friends, welcome to Higher Math Central. Today we are going to discuss another question on numerical analysis and the statement of the question is find the maximum absolute error incurred when a positive real number x which is expressed in n digit decimal representation is truncated to m digits where m is less than n. In second case, when it is rounded off to m digits where, where m is less than n. Also, we have to find the relation between the two errors. So, let us see the solution. So, let us uh, denote x star as the approximation of x when it is truncated to m digits. Now truncation means we discard all the digits beyond m, beyond dm. <coughs> so uh, the approximation x star becomes 0 0.d1 d2 up to dm. So the absolute error obtained in this case is equal to modulus of x minus x star equal to modulus of 0 point dm plus 1 dm plus 2 up to dn into 10 raised to power minus n. Here first m significant digits are 0 after subtraction therefore we have exponent minus m. Now important thing to note here is that D, uh, dm plus 1 is between 0 and 9 similarly dm plus 2 is between 0 and 9 so so the absolute error is bounded above by 0 0.999 into 10 raised to power minus m which is always less than 1 into 10 raised to power minus m Therefore, the maximum absolute error in, in the truncation case when it, uh, the number is truncated to m digits will be 10 raised to power minus m. Now, we consider the case for rounding off. Now, in rounding off, we have two cases. First let uh, x star denote the approximation of x when it is rounded off to m digits. Now the, there are two cases. In first case when the m plus 1th digit is uh, between 0 and 4 including 0 and 4 then x star is equal uh, the approximation will be 0 point d1 d2 up to dm that is we discard the m plus one uh, uh, discard the digits after mth digit so in this case the absolute error will be uh, z, uh, 0.dm uh, plus 1 dm plus 2 up to dn into 10 raised to power minus m now important thing to note here is that the m plus 1th digit is between 0 and 4. It cannot be 5 or more. So we can obtain uh, an upper bound of 0 0.49999 into 10 raised to power minus m because m plus 1th digit can be at most 4. So this is always less than 0 0.5 into 10 raised to the power minus m. Therefore, in this case, the absolute error is 0 0.5 into 10 raised to the power minus m. Now we consider the second case when m plus 1th digit is m plus 1th digit is between 5 and 9 including 5 and 9. In this case what we do is we add 1 to the m plus 1th digit and discard rest of the digits. 
therefore the approximation x star is equal to 0 point d1 d2 up to dm star where dm star is equal to dm plus 1 and dm star is such that 0 it is between 0 and 5 now the absolute error in this case is equal to dm star minus dm dot that is uh, dm star minus dm point dm plus 1 dm plus 2 up to dn into 10 raised to power minus m now we put the value of dm star so the absolute error becomes 1 minus 0 point dm plus 1 dm plus 2 up to dn whole modulus into 10 raised to power minus m now <coughs> here dm plus 1 is between 5 and 9 by the condition so the uh, value of 1 minus 0 point dm plus 1 will be between 0 0.1 and 0 0.5 so <coughs> when uh, so therefore the entire absolute error will be bounded above by 0 0.5 this well this cannot be greater than this value <coughs> thus the maximum absolute error again comes out to be 0 0.5 into 10 raised to power minus m when the number is rounded off to m digits which is half of the maximum absolute error obtained in truncation. So this was the solution. Thank you very much for listening.